Thank you for choosing Avalon Aluminum Railing Systems from the RDI Metalworks family of products. RDI's Avalon Aluminum Railing Systems offer unique style options that combine form, function, and versatility to add a rich, stylish look to your home while adding safety and security at the same time. Avalon's pre-assembled level and stair panels, easy install brackets, and pre-installed Securitec locking strip make installation fast and easy. Just select a top rail to complete your installation. First, place a plank on the stair noses spanning from post to post. Place the stair panel on the plank across the opening and adjust the balusters for plumb while ensuring equal baluster spacing on each end and clamp the panel into place. Next, you'll need to temporarily assemble the top and bottom stair mounting brackets. To do this, slide the brackets into the bracket bases, align bracket cover, and fasten together using the included hinge bolt. Hold the top bracket angled against the post face, aligned with the stair panel, and mark the bracket placement onto the post face and the rail panel. You'll need these marks to determine where to cut later on. Repeat this step for the other end. Now let's measure for the bottom brackets. Align the bottom bracket to the bottom rail. Hold the bottom bracket against the post face, aligned with the stair panel, and mark the bracket placement onto the post face. Add 3 quarters of an inch toward the rail end or post to the marks made in the panel. You'll need these marks to determine where to cut later on. Repeat this step for the other end. Next, cut the railing panel at the marks that you just made. Next, loosely assemble the mounting base and cover to use as a template to mark locations for pre-drilling. Place the bracket mounting base on the post aligned with the marks made previously, ensuring that the brackets are properly oriented. Mark the two hole locations shown for each bracket and pre-drill using a 1 8 inch bit. Secure the brackets to the post using the non-painted flathead 1 1⁄2 inch screws provided. Insert the bottom brackets into bottom rail and align the top brackets. To make things easier, you may want to temporarily secure the brackets with tape first, then test the panel for proper fit. Mark the bracket positions at all four locations and remove the brackets from the rail panel. Measure the length of the rail panel and cut the top rail sold separately to the same length. Press down on the top rail to ensure that it fits snugly onto the panel. Align the top stair bracket with the rail end only at the top of the stairs. Using the pre-drilled holes as a guide, drill through the railing using a 1 8 inch bit, being careful not to drill through the top rail. Be sure to only do this for the top of the stairs only. Next, place the top rail end covers onto both ends of the top rail. Slide the top brackets onto the rail ends, ensuring that the top rail end covers nest into the grooves of the brackets. Align the bracket, panel, and top rail. Drive two 1 1⁄2 inch painted pan head screws through the pre-drilled holes, locking the assembly together at the top of the stair. Slide all four brackets into the bracket bases connected to the posts. Slide the bracket covers onto the bases and loosely secure into place with hinge bolts. Pre-drill the top rail at the bottom stair post using the bracket holes as a guide. Drive two 1 1⁄2 inch painted pan head screws up through the holes locking the bracket, panel, and top rail together. Once the top rail is secured, tighten all four of the hinge bolts to lock the stair panel into place. Lastly, install a pyramid post top onto each post. 
Thanks for watching our video and for purchasing RDI products. Please visit us at www.rdirail.com for other valuable information and other fine RDI products.